Welcome back everybody. Today I got a product review for you. This is the Old Town Vapor 10 Angler Edition. It's a newer style kayak that has come out from Old Town and it is fantastic. Um, summertime Ken recently picked this uh, kayak up and uh, we've had the pleasure of testing it out and uh, he really likes it a lot. I've gotten to use it a couple times. <clears throat> I thoroughly enjoy paddling around in it. Um, it is a sit inside. So you can see there the chair is hard mounted to the kayak. It does have the adjustable back by pulling on this string which comes up right there. You can actually pull on it and it will adjust the back forward or backwards. So that's a pretty awesome feature as well as these knee pads right here to keep you from banging up your knees or scratching them as you're paddling around. So we'll start at the back, work our way forward. What we have here is we have uh, the hard mounted handles here. They're plastic handles. They're very sturdy, awesome. So much better than the rope style features that some other kayak brands use. It does have an anchor trolley that runs down half the length of the kayak. It comes factory like that. Also with this nice little swivel there, or pulley, excuse me. So it does come with a small anchor. Uh, of course, he's got his life jacket, net, and everything in there. But this little storage compartment has got some water in it from paddling around. But it's nice. It uh, can hold a very small cooler or uh, maybe grocery sack full of stuff. He puts his small tackle box, life jacket, t-shirt back there. It does have these two rod holders on the side. They are mounted at a very nice angle. Um, this is a smaller rod, so it doesn't quite fit in there, but a normal rod would sit up about like this. So you can see, <clears throat> excuse me, comes up at a nice 45 degree angle out from the kayak. Really, really nice for trolling. Spreads it out away from the back of the kayak so your, lang your lines don't get tangled. All right, moving forward, of course, you have the inside part here. In the back, it does have a little bit of storage back there underneath. As you can see, it does have the styrofoam to keep it floating. If it does fill up with water, it's not going to sink to the bottom like a rock. <clears throat> up in the front also storage it's got these nice foot pegs right here you can see one there one on the other side they are adjustable as well by pulling on this you can see it's adjustable locks right in so nice feature as well helps you propel yourself through the water up front you got a little dashboard here with uh, two compartments on the other side and a drink holder and uh, then it's got some bungee straps up front move around here comes factory with these little bungee straps right here small area for the bungee straps but not uh, not to be without honestly you have to have this if you want to attach any gear sleeping bag or something like that dry bag to it that's an awesome feature keeps it up and out of your uh, your cockpit area so um, it does have the the lip around the edge here so that you can use it with a uh, one of those skirts the neoprene skirts that way it can be a little more waterproof on the inside if you get into some rapids or something you can use that skirt that attaches also to you and then it hooks around the edge nice feature there so another awesome thing they did was on the plastic when they molded it they cut out these little grooves and uh, that's also just for your paddle to rest in so you got a nice sturdy spot to put your paddle while you're casting or just floating down the river so up front you can see it comes to a point instead of a blunt nose move around here so you can see there it does come to a point so it cuts the water extremely well it is a fast kayak I have to say it is very very fast in the water much faster than my little ocean kayak over here but a 10 foot long it's not the most uh, not the most effective when it comes to tracking so it does weeble and wobble a little bit but uh, overall fantastic uh, speed in the water so there you have it I just kind of cover most of the the general features with the kayak you can check out my description below for some more uh, information on this kayak and also a link on where you may be able to find this kayak for purchase so uh, there you have it it's the Old Town Vapor 10 Angler number nine
number 8. The Sundolphin Excursion 10 was designed for an amazing fishing experience. In this kayak, it is a little easier to catch the big one and more fun to keep trying all day long. It tracks and paddles with ease while providing maximum stability. The padded seat and foot braces adjust for your comfort, and the paddle holder keeps your hands free for fishing. The Excursion 10 is lightweight and easy to carry and has a large open cockpit. A handy bottle holder for your beverage convenient swivel fishing rod holder, and protective thigh pads. Flush mount rod holders for the true fisherman. Storage compartment with lid and bungees for your extra gear. Rugged and dent resistant, this kayak is built to last for a lifetime. So take your time and paddle slowly along the shoreline, or spend the entire day in search of that ideal spot to cast your line. Whether you're on the lake or the river, you can always count on the Excursion 10 Kayak to be your perfect fishing companion. Number 7 Lifetime Products offers a full line of recreation kayaks, perfect for your next outdoor excursion. The innovative sit-on-top kayak design has opened a new era in paddle sports that appeals to the spirit of adventure in all of us. People of all ages and skill levels now enjoy exploring lakes, oceans, and other flat water paddling with Lifetime Kayaks. The Lifetime 6-foot wave kayak is specifically designed for kids ages 5 and up or up to 130 pounds. One of the main features of the wave is the extreme safety and stability offered while on board the kayak. The wide platform and unique hole design makes it very difficult to tip over. For added safety, a rear swim-up platform makes it easy for kids to get into the kayak from the water. With safety and stability being our main focus, Lifetime Kayaks are perfect for families and kids. Kayaking provides great exercise for your little ones, giving them the perfect reason to get outside and enjoy the fresh open air. The Wave has multiple footrest positions for different sized riders, and the molded ergonomic seating design enhances the balance and motor skills as your child paddles. Lifetime kayaks are specifically made for convenient transportation and storage. With the front T-carry handle and 18-pound lightweight designs, kids can easily carry the wave to and from the waterfront. It easily fits on roof racks, truck beds, or in the back of a van or SUV. Our kayaks conveniently stack together, allowing multiple kayaks to be strapped on top of a vehicle or easily stored in a closet or compartment without taking up much room. Constructed of blow molded high density polyethylene, Lifetime kayaks are UV protected so they will not fade or turn brittle in the sunlight. Our kayaks are durable and impact resistant to prevent denting and scratching. Molded finger handles, scupper holes, and paddle cradles are built into the kayak for added convenience. This unique recreational kayak is entirely designed to create the best kayaking experience possible for children. So take your family on your next outdoor paddling adventure with the Wave Kayak from Lifetime Products. Number six. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, first off, I'm gonna change my fishing channel from Corey Weir to Corey's Extreme Kayak Fishing. Um, got a new kayak, and I know I'm gonna be having fun this spring. We're gonna have, we're gonna be doing some cool stuff. Um, we'll start off. I uh, got the Sun Dolphin Bally. 10 SS I know some people might say oh you know that's cheap or whatever but really it's $260 um, I price matched it for $199 it came with tax like 214 but uh, yeah I, this is all I need this is amazing I'm just going to lakes you got your storage there for your lures or whatever you want um, let's go over some facts here it's 10 feet long it's 30 inches wide, 11 inches in height, 44 pounds of temperature it weighs, and it holds 250 pounds. Uh, Two-year warranty, uh, comes with paddles, uh, but it doesn't feel like it weighs 44 pounds. With one arm, I can do it right behind, you know, over my head. Um, but the seat's real comfortable. Like, I went to Dick's and looked at a few for 
under $200 worth paddles. This is a very, very great buy. Uh, you got your cup holder, any kind of, you know, hot, cold. Um, you got storage for your GoPro, keys, phone, whatever. It doesn't matter. I could fit my whole hand in there. Got other little rubber storage. Um, you got the leg rest. And you got another storage here, here. Um, you got your foot adjusters if you're tall or short. Um, your pad or your uh, paddle holders. Um, but I, like I said, this thing is awesome. I'm so happy. Came with two paddles that you know you got connect them for free. Uh, if not, they're like thirty dollars. I saw at Walmart. But uh, yeah, it's awesome. A few little flaws that I see with this, but you guys gotta remember, it's two hundred dollars. Um, the stickers already. Look at it. it's falling off already um and this rubber or the string keeps coming out i just fixed it too um but yeah that kept popping out you just gotta get any kind of screwdriver and you'll see if it comes out just bend the metal but you know that's awesome um other thing was i don't know if it was assembled wrong enough you guys can see the screws are coming out. They're not all the way in. These are all the way in. These screws are out. I looked at the other one. They were like that too. Uh, so, you know, just minor things. But stickers, the screw, but for $200. Come on. And it has a little handle here that you can pull it up with. Um, it's self-balancing. It's not like those shallow ones. Or the narrow ones that it's going to tip over. You can actually stand up. And you go stand up in the water. I'll show you guys as soon as I put it in the water. Next week it's supposed to be nice here. I live in Pennsylvania. And it's it's still cold. Uh, but it should be warming up. But th this, is, this is awesome. Um, please like, comment, subscribe. Please to help me out. Um, and yeah, I'll make more videos. And we'll uh, go from there. Thanks guys. Bye for now. Number five. Hi, good day. Today we're going to uncompartmentalize and assemble the advanced frame convertible kayak model number AE1007. This is not your standard issued kayak. It's a day touring expedition model specifically designed for tandem adventures. Runs approximately four and a half meters in length and about a meter at its widest. Weighing in a tad over 23 kilos, it allows for a maximum passenger and cargo capacity, just a pinch under 250. First up is the flippers, which you're going to want to insert one at a time. We're going to dive in head first at the bow, followed by the stern, with a pat for good measure. Next up is your dick. Every watercraft needs a dick. First you need to toss and unravel that dick. It'll run the entire length of the vessel. And it's important to keep your dick tucked in. You don't want your dick flapping out on the water. Nice and gentle at first, but then it's safe to get more aggressive as you continue to stuff your dick in there. Here we have a standard issued PSR device with every possible nipple adapter you could imagine. Wow, that's a lot of nipples. And look at the hands on that bloke. I bet he works for Rolex with a set like that. Now with a professional watercraft of this nature, you're going to need a lot of PSR. I'm talking serious PSR. One, two, three, five thousand PSR. It might take a bit, but you don't want to sink out there. When you're out on the water, you're going to need that PSR. So really, really cram that PSR in there as much as possible. So what's specific about the AE1007 model is that it's got two chambers requiring PSR. So you're going to want to save some of that energy for the second chamber. Stamina is key, here and on the water. The pouch that you see on my side there, that's first aid. That's going to keep you safe in the water, got a nice blade in there. Sharks, you're going to want to stab them right in the eyeball. That's the only way to get rid of a shark. Don't forget about the C-47s either, you can, you know, plug the nose of that shark. Then he won't be able to get any air. How's he going to bite you if he doesn't have any air? What separates cocks from canoes is the seats, and this tandem fella here comes with a pair. That way, you and a mate, maybe a Sheila, 
can go for a nice romp around the harbour. Free as can be. All right, all right, all right. Now it's showtime. Assembly is complete and it's time to get wet. It's important you board your vessel correctly. Nice and easy, you don't want to pull anything. And don't forget to have fun out there, because after all, that's what it's all about. Good, clean, fun. All right. Number four. The Sea Eagle Fast Track is a new kind of inflatable kayak. Its revolutionary design combines the performance of a rigid kayak with the portability and stability of an inflatable kayak. Just 35 pounds, simply unroll, inflate, and go. The Fast Track has enough room to comfortably support two kayakers and all their gear. The fast track is fast, light, and easy to paddle. The secret is its patent pending hull design that is engineered to paddle faster and easier. Unlike ordinary kayaks that wander side to side as you paddle, the fast track tracks straight and true. It's even stable enough to stand up in. You have to go underwater to understand exactly why the fast track paddles so easily and so straight. The patent pending high pressure drop stitch bow keel parts the water, provides buoyancy to ride over waves, and prevents the side to side movement so common in other kayaks. 
The large skeg at the stern keeps the fast track on a straight course. The super rigid high pressure drop stitch floor has underwater side walls that enhance the tracking performance. With the Sea Eagle Fast Track, you can get to locations otherwise inaccessible or impractical to get to. Beautiful lakes and rivers, pristine camping locations. The Sea Eagle Fast Track will let you enjoy the outdoors in ways you never thought possible. Number two. You can have this inflatable kayak in big water, flat water, and rivers, and you will never feel unsafe. Its sleek, asymmetrical shape is tapered and narrow at the bow, while being wider at the stern. This allows it to punch through the waves faster and easier. This kayak handles 90% as good as a hard shell and is very fast too. It can easily cruise at 3 plus miles per hour, which is impressive for an inflatable. It has so much room, you can pack your whole house in this thing. This boat far exceeds most people's expectations. So, I'll do a quick little review for anybody that was interested in this one. It's the uh, Tamarack Angler 120. It's made by Lifetime. I got it at Big Five. It was on sale, normally 300, and uh, it was on t I think 269. Yeah, and then 10% off. It was 260 out the door without a paddle. So this is an entry level kayak, which is fine with me because I'm not spending a bunch of money on a kayak. They're all. $500, $600 for one that's just basically the similar style. So I went with this one, and uh, so far uh, I'm actually 
I'm happy with it. I wish I would have plugged the scuffle holes, <laughs> getting a little more wet than I want to. But uh, otherwise, uh, plane's good, stays on track, uh, weighs 50 pounds. It wasn't too heavy, but with the gear on it, all that good stuff, you know, it's a little, a little heavier. But um, quality's good. Plastic is pretty thick. It comes with a couple bungees up front to tie down your gear, and then there's some bungees in the back. Uh, seat's decent. It's kind of thin on the bottom. The backrest is pretty thick. And then it comes with uh, two dry boxes. That uh, basically is just the compartment inside. And uh, it has another one back there under that box. Uh, cup holder. And then the adjustable feet. I like that better than the rails that slide because they don't rust out. But um, yeah, so I mean, so far so good. 260 bucks. You really can't.